This is the HTA 100BT. So this amplifier for its price range comes with a lot of features. So right over here we have phono, augs, bluetooth, optical, coax, and USB input. And it has a nice on off power switch that goes. And we have the input select source button. Change your input select source. And you have the pause play button and the back skip and the forward skip. And the bass and treb knobs for flat mode, there's like this tiny notch when you turn it just to make sure it's like in the center. It like auto stops on this notch. The volume goes all the way to right there to right there. It's nice, smooth, high quality. So now let's take a look at the back of the amplifier. So now we're here at the back of the amp. The back of the amp has to offer a optical input, subwoofer out, and a coaxial input. An AUG is left right, and a phono left right, as well as a USB input and a ground. And here you have your screw terminals plus banana plugs. And it comes equipped with a cooling fan for the class AB amplifier and it has the, the standard 120 plug on it. For me personally, when hooking up my speakers, I use banana plugs because they're easier and simpler to use. And this amplifier has been great to me. It has high, qu high quality sound and it has a lot of bass for its size. It is 100 watts, class AB, 100 watt amp. And the um, the cooling fan on the back turns on or revs up with more or less bass that is in the song. Say if the bass drops, the fan turns on, and as soon as you're done listening to your music or it's paused, the fan stays on for a little while, then it shuts off. I personally don't mind it because it's quiet compared to my speakers that I use, so. This overall is a good amp, and let's get to the sound test. So this is a test of the Shure MV88. Brown eyes, no golden skin. Do you have my time to pull me in? No ocean smile, 
Can it fool us? That is born all along the way. Well, I did my best just to make you stay. You shut it down. You run away. You toss and turn, crash and burn, slip right. Okay, so that's all I'm going to do for right now. And if you're interested in this microphone, it is the Shure MV88. Okay, so the setup has not changed other than I replaced my B652s with B652 Airs. And how I got the placement the same is I put some electrical tape and all that stuff to line it up. So let's get going. Close my Brown eyes, no golden skin. They hypnotize to pull me in. No ocean smile, any fool could see that it's born all along the me. Well, I did my best just to make you stay. You shut it down, you run away You toss and turn, crash and burn, slip right Oh, oh, I'm on to you Oh, I'm to me, well I'm not the same As the day before, I ever knew your name I closed my eyes Okay, that is the Shure MV88 with the B652 Airs and the Dayton Audio HTA100BT.